I'm going to talk about the strike from a film worker's perspective. I'm not in the WGA or the Screen Actors Guild. I'm a member of IOTSE, the International Alliance of Theatrical Stage Employees. We have over 180,000 members, which make up most of the film crew, including the camera department, hair, makeup, art, props, grip, electricians, many others. Now, we are not on strike, but we do stand side by side with the actors and the writers, which means we're not crossing any picket lines. And with the exception of some commercial work and a few independent shows with SAG waivers, we're not working. Am I nervous? Yeah. The series I work on ended in March and won't start back up until the strike's over. And besides a little commercial work, things are pretty bleak. But it's all necessary. The outcome of this will set a precedent for all other union negotiations from here on out. This isn't about millionaires wanting money from billionaires. The average SAG actor makes around 69000 annually. They want what the whole industry wants fair wages and fair treatment, union strong, done.